Butcher trained Olivia Wolf to react fast under attack. Samuel stands over her. She's winded from the fall. The hut lights dazzle. She squints up at the assassin. It's imperative she gets up. While she's prostrate, she's at his mercy. Except for them, the camp is deserted and nobody knows where she is. Samuel leans in. She blinks. What's in his hand? A syringe? Wolf reacts, turns on her side, props herself up on one arm and kicks fast and hard at his hand over and over, pounding him with thick-soled boots. She mustn't let him use a syringe. As she kicks, she claws at the floor, dragging herself away from the killer, but he keeps coming. A powerful kick to the stomach has Samuel reeling back. Wolf jumps up, then hurtles down the steps to the exterior deck, jumps the deck's barrier, drops into blackness, landing four feet below. Wolf sprints for the waterhole. She prays it's deep enough to hide in. The water is shockingly cold. The mud sucks at her boots. She wades in further, heading for the dense reeds, her clothes heavy, dragging her down. Warthogs snort in panic and scatter tails high. Samuel gives chase, leaves the hut lights on. Good. Surely somebody will see them, or is everybody asleep? Shoving the reeds out of her way, she heads for deeper water. Stay still and duck low or keep moving. She peers behind her, can't see him. Wolf kneels behind dense reeds, the muddy water up to her shoulders. Is there something in the water Samuel fears? Snakes? Hippos? Wolf dares not move. A snap as a reed breaks. The water ripples. Something or someone is very near. <laughs>